Hey friends, and welcome back to The Daily Burke. Today we are talking about how to overcome imposter syndrome. Right, we've all been in that situation. Maybe we're like, we're the only person in the room that doesn't deserve to be there, we think, right? Or we think that like, I should have never gotten this job and if they find out I'm not qualified, I'm in huge trouble. We've all been in those situations. At its core, imposter syndrome is kind of a situation where our belief in our internal abilities, our knowledge, skills, abilities, capacity, our self-efficacy, we did a prior episode about self-efficacy, where our self-efficacy is lower than what the people around us see. But the truth is, you would have never been invited into that room if the others didn't believe that you deserve to be there. I mean, unless you're actually running a con, like a catch me if you can thing, in which case, I don't have a video to help you. Um, there might be one out there, you can search. But stay with me, we'll talk about this because this is probably a problem that affected you before you started faking it anyway. But if you're not faking it, if you just feel like you're faking it, like you don't deserve to be there, then the core of the problem is that your belief in yourself is lower than the belief in the people that are looking at you. And the truth is they're probably looking highly at you for a reason, you've just forgotten it. So one of the best activities that I've found that helps people uh, increase their self-efficacy and overcome imposter syndrome is what's known as the reflected best self exercise. It works like this. You take uh, about a dozen, 10, 15 or so of your friends, peers, colleagues, whatever's appropriate for this situation, and you ask them to reflect back on a time when you were at your best self. Ask them to tell you about a time where you demonstrated incredible knowledge or where you really you completed that project in time, under budget, wherever it was that you shined. Because the truth is, they saw you at your best. You might even want to say that question. When was a time when I was at my best in this capacity? They probably remember and you don't, right? Write it down, see if they'll videotape it for you or audio record it, you can play it back to yourself, but keep consuming their belief in you to grow your own self-efficacy. So the problem with the imposter syndrome is that we see ourselves as lower than the people in the room with us see us. So the best way to overcome it is to survey the people in the room and remind yourself why you were invited to be there in the first place. That is how we overcome imposter syndrome. Thanks so much for watching The Daily Burke. Uh, leave a comment, let me know if you've ever struggled with imposter syndrome or if, there was a, if you did this activity or if there was some other activity that you did to help overcome it and let me know how it worked. And while you're there, make sure you follow or subscribe because we're posting new episodes every single day and you're not gonna miss them. We'll see you next time.